Now, before we start anything, uh, I'm going to actually stick my fingers into this power socket so that I could actually carry on with the video. Because you see, my mental acumen is so sharp that I'm going to be a skeptic. And so I'm going to have to stick my finger in the socket so I could turn myself retarded so that maybe I could actually comprehend what's going on in the video. So uh, here we go. Uh, if I don't make it, join uh, the Pick Cake Magic Academy, the home of over 1,400 videos going over card stuff, coin stuff, everything you need to become the best magician you could possibly be, or that, or, uh, buy my book, or buy my book. I finally found it. After years of searching, I finally found proof of psychic telekinetic powers. Who would have known that all it took was scrolling through TikTok and eventually you would find a real example of telekinesis. Now, if you don't know what telekinesis is because you were born under a rock and you're an idiot non-believer, this is what it is. It's the ability to move things with the power of your mind. Now I had to replace the music on that clip because it would give me a copyright hit and I don't need another one of those. But as you can see, the 5.9 decides to wave her hands around this piece of foil and it moved. A genuine display of psychic ability. She's harnessing the power given to her by the gods above and she used it to move a piece of foil. Now I've put so much effort in attempting this myself, but unfortunately I haven't been successful. Now she does say that she uses music to enhance her psychic powers. So let's see if that helps. All right, so hopefully you could see the stool here. I got a piece of foil and uh, I'm gonna be balancing it precariously on its edge. This is actually a lot harder to do than you would imagine. Uh, I'm actually not gonna cut this. People would cut this out of the video, but I'm not gonna. I'm gonna show you how hard it is to balance a piece of foil on its end and uh, hope that it gives you the idea. I had to cut the video. All right, so I'm gonna use a bigger piece of foil. I think that might help in the balancing act that I'm trying to do here. It also doesn't help that I'm doing this uh, with the fan. There's a fan aimed in this direction. Uh, so I'm gonna try my best to do that. Um, okay, this is actually getting stupid at this point. Of all the days that the air conditioner is actually turned on and aggressive, uh, it's today. It's today when I'm trying to shoot this video. Now here there's a comment from a person that thinks that uh, they know how it's done. And they say, and I quote, Girl, you gotta prove to me that there's no string attached. Cry emoji, cry emoji, cry emoji, cry emoji, please. I don't really like to prove myself, but I'm a Capricorn, so we just gonna do that. But this is just the foil. Um, as you can see, there's, there's no string. Nothing. Um, <clears throat> we'll uncrumple it. <gasps> I broke my foil. I just ran out of foil. I don't have any more. So like, I'm gonna have to go to that dollar store to get me some more telekinesis practice material. I'm so fucking weird. I kind of have to like get it folded in a way to like stand up, if that makes sense. But that's about as much as I manipulate it like that. Now this is me blowing on it. See that? So it's not air, it's literally my hand. She also proves in the video that she's not using air. She's using genuine psychic powers. As a matter of fact, in the next video, she decides to dunk on a hater. Air. Wind. Energy. You could clearly see the difference between air and energy displayed in the video. Air is easy. Air is easy to 
cause something to move. In this case, you could see I could put this right here. And just by virtue of it being near a fan, the thing goes all over the place. That's air. She's obviously using energy. So she's using energy and not wind. And if you're a, a skeptic, a, se a septic, as I like to call you, you're just wrong. You're an idiot because you can clearly see the difference here between when she's using wind to move the stupid little piece of foil and when she's using her psychic powers. Did you guys notice that this is a little busted? It's a little broken? That's weird, right? I don't, it's almost like somebody's been messing with it. I guess if I just... <laughs> Oh, man. Oh, I'm not retarded anymore. Yeah, that bitch is dumb. It's stupid. Why does she think that she has psychic powers? It's clearly wind. Look at this video where she claims that her PK psychokinetic ability has been enhanced by stepping outdoors. I urge you to replicate the exact video that you're doing, but do it, do it from here and do it like this. Do it like this. I don't want you to have a sweeping action with your hand. I want you to do it like this, just like that. As a matter of fact, let's see if I can make it happen uh, like that. But let's use my energy. Let's use my chi. Let's just charge it up. Charging my chi, charging my chi, charging my chi. So clearly I have the exact same psychic powers. Uh, some advice at the end of the video. I like to give advice at the end of the video that's not pertinent to the actual video itself. Uh, buy my book. That's the advice that I'm giving you. It's a fun magic book. It goes over some card stuff. It goes over some anecdotes, uh, the way I came up with the tricks. And it's a fun read. You should pick it up, especially for Christmas. Give it to your magic virgin friend that's looking for a new tome. And uh, you'll see that it'll improve their life because it makes them realize that there's someone out there that's lonelier and sadder. I see you again when 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 I see you again.